Friends slithering to the scaly exotic creatures will be all over the Arapahoe County Fairgrounds this weekend. It's called Repticon Denver. It features thousands of reptiles. I got one right here. Hello, sweetheart. Amphibians. Natalie, you should come out here. Much, much more. Devin Jaffe from Nature's Educators is here to tell us more. And a lot of people do like to go see reptiles and amphibians and yeah. birds like this. Tell us about Nature's Educators. So Nature's Educators is a 501c3 nonprofit organization uh, licensed under the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service uh -huh. to care for non-releasable birds of prey. We also take care of reptiles, amphibians, and invertebrates as well. So w if they get injured, they come to you? We are actually the stage after that. So if somebody's injured, they would go to a, a rehabilitation facility. And then, come and, then, and then they could come to us if they can't be released back to the and wild. Now, tell us about this beautiful uh, bird of prey. Sure. So this is Ajax. He is a five-year-old American kestrel, the smallest falcon species here in the United States. Um, this bird was found blind in his right eye. We're not 100% mm. sure why or what happened to him. Um, unfortunately, with a one-eyed falcon, he doesn't have the ability to create that really good 3D imagery right. to be able to catch his prey. Hi, sweetheart. You're beautiful. And how about Mr. Snake here? Yeah, so this is our snake. We actually named him Cobra Commander, but obviously not a Cobra. It's not a Cobra. He's w <laughs> and it, by the way, he's warming up. That's why he's uh, kind of getting moving excited. Around. Yeah, he's getting excited. Hi, yeah. buddy. He is a glossy snake, which a is glossy a glossy snake. Yeah, and you can kind of see the beautiful shine on the scales where they oh, get the yeah. name. Um, they are a native species here in Colorado, they but are. they are nocturnal, so very difficult to see. Oh, okay, and yeah. they basically eat small rodents or yeah, bugs. Yeah, small rodents, and insects, yep, frogs and toads. So if people want to know more about Nature's Educators, do they have a website? Yep, we have a website. It's just natureseducators.org. Um, okay. We have a Facebook page, Twitter, all that kind of great stuff. Glad to see you this morning, guys. Thank you very much sure. for coming in. Yeah, and Repticon, some of these animals will be there. Repticon Denver is this Saturday and Sunday at the Arapahoe County Fairgrounds. Doors open at 10 both days. It's $12 for adults, $5 for kids, 5 to 12. It's really neat to see all this stuff. You can find more details in the On TV section of our website, kwgn.com. And I'm going to take this snake, come back in and show Natalie. We'll be right back.